Hey, attention crypto gossipators, things are about to get interesting. Remember, not financial advice. Hey guys, what is up? Hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone's having an amazing day because I am as usual. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. So as we have it here, we are on a pump, okay? Maybe by the time this video comes down, well comes out it may go down or may go even higher so the point here that i'm trying to make um is that uh you know the prices obviously change so don't uh, always try to freak out just because the moment you open the video it has a completely different price to the graph because guys it takes time uh to you know put it out to write everything to schedule it but either way, guys, um, I am going to be actually uh, discussing a very important point, And this is in regards to your potential investing in cryptos um, and comparing it to just, you know, the average uh, way of making money, the way, you know, the average Joe makes money and just the average person. Now, guys, think about it. So many fudders out there and so many of these uh, negative people um are out there trying to spread their hate or their crap whatever for whatever reason it is okay because some may have not uh you know reached their you know ideas of becoming millionaires overnight others also have other thoughts um but in reality okay if we were to break everything down think about it isn't investing in cryptos just one of the easiest things that you could do in comparison to you know actually getting a manual job working and trying to make uh you know an amount of money guys with cryptos with a bull run you could absolutely change your lives and that is a fact i mean the amount of uh you know millionaire stories i have talked about uh or even billionaire stories and this was within the shib ecosystem as well and with other cryptos it is unreal and it does happen and uh, you think, well, why isn't everybody doing it then? Well, the main reason is because cryptos come with quite a negative image in general. Um, you know, the governments don't like it because uh, it can be, uh, you know, less traceable. Um, it's maybe less transparent. It's harder for them to regulate, to monitor. And obviously, you know, they would love to just create a cryptocurrency for uh, like a national currency, which would, they will do in the future, which could uh, absolutely control the world. And with cryptos, is harder. It's also harder, like I said, uh, to trace uh, certain developers, owners. And if it does go bust, then bang, you know, it's so hard to find uh, the person that is in charge. Rug pulls can happen. So many other things can happen. But this is the downside. But the upside is massive. The upside is that cryptos are so volatile that you know the upscale is insane you could put in a thousand bucks right yeah you could potentially lose a thousand dollars which would be very sad and you know uh heartbreaking but it doesn't ruin your whole life i mean how long are you going to be sad for i know it's different for for everyone but still you know how long are you going to be sad for but the thousand dollars could also go the other way and the other way could be 100x, 200x, 300x, 1000x, 5000x. So anything is possible. I mean, with a thousand bucks, you could potentially become a millionaire. I mean, that is how crazy it is. And if you don't take any risks in life, you, you won't live a uh, life. You won't be able to maximize or uh, take advantage of everything. And for some people, this type of money, a thousand dollars, two thousand dollars, isn't that much. Okay. They would have gone on a holiday somewhere with that money um, and spend that money in a few days. So. You know, you really have to think it through. Uh, having an investment like Bone, and I want to talk about Bone here, gives you a potential to change your lives. Okay, you're investing at 0 0.6, and if it goes to 65, say for example, it goes to, you get 100 grand. That's how crazy it is. So this is a uh, life-changing uh, opportunities here, okay? Life-changing money as well. You can make a ton of money um, here and many people have seen what potential we have reached when we were buying at 0 0.3 and we started reaching um, you know uh, two dollars 
people were 5xing their investments. And many people were contacting me. They were like, holy crap, you know, I, I'm sitting in the, this office making this just crap money. Um, and, there, and then I can invest and I can just make all the money uh, that I would just spend, you know, one or two years of my life working. So think about it. And money is very, a very important tool in life. Money is just a tool to make your life, you know, easier and to buy time as well. Because you could potentially really want to do something in your life, some business or something, and you're not doing it because of the fact that, uh, guys, listen to this, uh, you have to, uh, you know, ob obey by the matrix, meaning you have to live, you know, the nine to five or nine to six, whatever, and your whole life is just becomes like a survival and a struggle. And here it is, guys, an opportunity, a massive, massive opportunity uh, that could easily go make that money somewhere else. Because here we've got all the evidence, all the statistics, all the talk is here, all the facts, everything for it to rise. Simple as that. So stop, you know, uh, making it more complicated than it is. Stop falling for the FUD because FUD can exist everywhere. FUD has existed, you know, from the moment that... Bitcoin came out and yeah, P uh, Bitcoin made certain individuals very, very rich, very rich. Uh, but they had to go through FUD as well because people were saying, well, what is this Bitcoin thing? It's an absolute joke. This is intangible. What if it gets lost? Who's regulating this? Blah, 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 and so on. But you know what? Those that stuck through it made the most out of it. And right now we've got a layer two solution, Shibarium, and Bond's going to be used as a gas token on Shibarium. Shibarium is increasing. Look at the numbers. Look at the transactions. Look at the money getting pour, poured in. It's still in this ba baby steps, so obviously more of it will be coming in. So already great stuff. On top of it, we're going to get some big names coming in. Um, I think in general, you know, people are really understanding that this is a serious thing. There's a lot of money uh, to, to be made, and we shouldn't close our eyes on this. Simple as that. So please be prepared. Be ready. Um, because when the opportunity like this comes, you got to take it with both hands, with both hands. And next year, when we're talking about how, you know, our journey to the moon is nearly completed, we've got our portfolios absolutely maximizing it. We can start uh, start talking about, you know, how we're going to be using the money, whether we're purchase, making some big purchases or reinvesting back into some other cryptos. That's going to be the good talk. OK, that's going to be the dopamine effect and all that great stuff. But you're going to have to wait it out right now. OK, and I know sometimes that uh, it's not always going to go the way you want it to go. But, you know, these little glimpses of hope, I mean, these type of pumps, they show you what is possible. OK, and this probably a uh, little pump, you know, obviously I'm going to talk about it more. OK, do some more research into it once it's over the few cents. Um, it gets people really excited, but probably nothing that big happened. I mean, some volume went in, you know, probably a whale could have caused this. So, so it's just a minor thing but imagine in the future with a bull run when everybody's investing we see like crazy volumes when bitcoin is pumping you know uh, above the moon that is when it's going to get crazy that's where you're going to see you know the definition of demand and supply and you'll see how supply is being put out demands coming in and it is getting interesting simple as that okay because all this stuff all these little candles look at it it's going down what well, i'm going to be very sad there's a red candle, of course not, you know, pumps goes down, uh, it goes down. But in the end, I am waiting for, you know, the big picture for that big, big moment for big momentum. So I am ready for it. I don't know if you guys feel the same way. But either way, um, I would love you to subscribe to turn that notifications bell on comment, you know, be an active member of the uh, community here. Also, um, you know, uh, it'd be nice if you could like and share. Let's get this engagement at peak level. Let's spread the message. And that way we can actually gain more investors. And more investors means more demand, less supply, and higher price action. Simple as that. So, guys, thank you so much. I really do appreciate all the support. And I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.